what we've seen over the last 20 years is a large increase in the numbers of components to address clinical solutions. As a result, implant systems are now very complex and one may need to be a specialist to read the catalogue, let alone to use the product. That's a characteristic. Now, this does come with potential errors and potential risks. The risks of having a large system is a, if by that selection the clinician may not have the item or the product that they need to achieve the optimal conditions for a certain case. So there's a risk there. There's a risk of error, there's a risk of complications. The other error is in misselection, is in actually not having the ability to choose the right components, the optimal component, under the right conditions. Simplifying the number of components and simplifying the number of instruments results in a simplification of the procedure. This increases the, uh, the, treatment, the, the speed of treatment, but it also reduces and eliminates the, uh, any errors due to the incorrect selection of components or the unavailability of components. One of the things about the NEOS system is, although it's very simple, it's very refined and extremely well developed. So we can put the NEOS system in the hands of the, the most expert surgeon in the world and they will appreciate and understand the benefits and handling characteristics of the system. Not only the simplicity of the instruments in terms of the number, but also the way the components handle the way the implant works surgically, the stability it creates, are immediately obvious. Experts used to be able to vary their surgical technique depending on the clinical complexity of the case and depending on the bone quality. What we've done is distill that skill into the implant geometry so that now clinicians can use a predictable and simple technique to achieve a result which will be extremely stable and extremely successful. For clinicians, the NEO system will increase their accessibility to patient treatment. It will enable them to provide implant treatment for a broader base of patients.